Glenn Grover Norquist. Grover. I'm Glenn Anderson. My middle name is Glenn. My parents went with Grover Glenn. I had two grandparents, one Grover, one Glenn. I kept thinking maybe I'd have a brother, Glenn Grover, but that didn't work out. And I did get Grover Glenn instead of Thor or Sigurd, which were the other two options. So I think I probably did okay. Oh, you're Scandinavian, I guess. That's why they were yeah. thinking Thor and Sigurd, yeah. <laughs> Grover works. <laughs> One of the challenges, one of the damages that gun control advocates cause when they threaten more gun control and then everybody wants to run out and buy a gun and more ammunition, this does what to the market that makes it tough for you? Non availability? Is this non availability? So, older bullets are not being made, older brass is not being made for obsolete guns. So, you've got Orphan guns for which it's difficult or even impossible to buy ammunition. No longer serviceable. You cannot use it and protect your home to go hunting for your family. Or and if there was a conflict, it's rendered useless. And there are, in some cases, millions of these guns out there. There are millions of guns. Unable to get ammunition. Exactly. Yeah because the manufacturers are busy making too much ammunition for other products because of the demand driven up by Obama's gun control. They did not intentionally yeah. uh, make the gun obsolete, but they did, did an in business decision to stay afloat okay. and to supply people with ammunition to defend themselves in a more common caliber. So we look at the first order, as an economist, we look at the first order effect, which is Obama threatens gun control, people go out, buy more guns, buy more ammunition. But the second order is, some of the older ammunition doesn't get made because they're so busy filling the new orders and then guns, a million of them, become paperweights. Yes, exactly. Oh, for heaven's sakes. Okay, uh, I now have uh, one more reason not to be excited about Obama. I was warming to him, but now, I don't know, it's not gonna work. Warming to Obama? Yeah, right. Reason 74, okay, to be unhappy. 74 reasons, that all? Well, it's 74 I could think of this morning when I got up. Thank you. You're welcome. Good to see you.